All right, so I just want to clarify here that the, the process basically. So start out, if you got fired brass, start out using something like this. This is that universal decapping die. Uh, punch out all your primers, clean your cases if you need to after that to get all the carbon and crap off of them. And then once they're clean, ready to go, you will obviously still need to lube them before you use this. Lube them up. I use uh, a mixture of lanolin and alcohol. It's the same stuff as this Dillon case lube right here. Um, I just reuse this bottle, mix it up myself with uh, 90 some percent alcohol and this stuff right here works awesome. Just make sure you remove it right away because it gets sticky and gets harder to remove as the longer you let it sit on the case. So moving on, uh, once your cases are ready to size and lubed up, insert this die set up, your full length die with the guts removed into your press and run them all through this thing. And once they're all through this, they'll be full length sized and the cases will be shrunk down smaller than they need to be. And then take this mandrel set up and run them all back through that. Put this, take that out of your press, put this in, then run them back all through here. And just make sure if you need to, the screw that comes with them like this, that keeps the case from going too far up and bottoming out on here and getting smashed. So you wanna be careful of that. You don't smash your cases into this thing. So that's what that screw is used for is to, uh, the screw will bottom out in the bottom of the case and prevent it from going too far up. So anyways, run them all through, back through again, using the mandrel, that'll open all their necks back up. And then once that's done, they're, they're sized. So all you need to do at that point is trim them to the right length, chamfer, deburr de them as usual, and uh, you're good to go. So you don't need to do anything else. It's just a two-step sizing process. You gotta go through once and then go back through once with this and then back through with the mandrel. So it's two steps, but trust me, it's it's worth it. It's uh, it's superior. You'll, you'll like it. It's easy, it's cheap, it's awesome.